Hey Scrappers, Moose here. So in this video I've got something uh, I've never had before and this is an old computer component to a vehicle. Uh, I'm not quite sure the maker model, it says Mitsubishi on it, but when I found it it was dripping with water so I'm assuming it's, it's not good anymore. Um, so yeah, we're going to take this puppy apart and see what's inside. So I've been noticing more and more that uh, like places like Boardsort actually have that as one of their um, things that they buy. So, I'm curious to see what's inside. I've never opened one up. So, let's take a look. Alright, so it looks like we've just got a couple of Phillips screws on the sides here. And yes, I do save all of my screws. I've got a bucket in the corner of my desk. Pick everything up with a magnet when I'm done. Okay, so let's finish taking off all these screws. This one's got to be stubborn. Alright, so separate that out. Take my magnet. Steel. Steel. Even those little things are steel. And this. So we've got a chunk of aluminum there. And one, two, three IC chips. And I think that's about it. Now this may contain some tantalum, uh, but clearly this is older. And I'm not sure if there's anything else of any value on it. I don't see any monolithic ceramics. I don't see anything else. So. I may be wrong, but I could I would probably consider this a low grade board. So maybe I just got a crappy computer one. And the insides here are not even gold plated. Alright. Alright, well that's it for a Mitsubishi F241A. Whatever that means. Um, Alright, so if you have any questions, comments, any suggestions, anything you want to see me scrap, just let me know. See you on the next one.